Lawsuit over bug-issued ICX token bonanza can go forward, Judge Rules. Hello everybody, and welcome back to Lunar Crypto. And so today let's talk about this article written by Leo Jacobson. This was published on August 11, 2021 on CoinMarketCap.com. An Icon Network staker can go ahead with a lawsuit demanding the return of 14 million ICX tokens he obtained after discovering a bug in the decentralized finance aggregator blockchain. Federal District Judge William Oreck of the Northern District of California shot down Icon's attempt to dismiss the lawsuit in an August 9th order, finding that plaintiff Mark Shen has a plausible claim. The judge found that the case raises novel questions about digital property according to Law 360. The case addresses property rights concerning blockchain and decentralized technology, a relatively fresh legal frontier. In August 2020, Shin discovered that an update to the decentralized protocol added 25,000 ICX tokens to his account when he transferred his stake tokens from a One Network Node Public Representative or PRAP to another. He did this repeatedly, amassing a cache of ICX tokens. When the Icon Foundation discovered the bug, it convinced Binance and Kraken to freeze Shin's accounts. He promptly sued, saying that while he acknowledged that the authors and developers of the Revision 9 proposal may not have intended for the network proposal to behave as it did. This was the proposal that the PRAPs had agreed to and did adopt into the network. That Shin added makes him lawful owner of the 14 million ICX tokens rewarded to him on August 22, 2020. While those tokens were worth as much as $11 million at the time of their creation, they were worth nearly $17 million on the day the judge ruled. Misconduct or scapegoating? Shin also accused Icon of making false allegations that he was a malicious attacker who acquired stolen funds. An earlier version of the lawsuit was tossed and Shin removed several allegations including defamation. But Judge Ork noted, Shin also added allegations that Icon publicly targeted him as a scapegoat to distract from its culpability in introducing the Revision 9 minting bug and at the same time sought to cover up the fact that many of its close affiliates received ICX tokens from the same mechanism as Shin. Among these were Velik, Staking Team, ICX Station, and HyperConnect, said Shin's legal team. Judge Oryx said, Shin added that the Icon Foundation has de facto control of the network and used a new update, Revision 10, which effectively locked Shin out of his ICX wallet. The argument, Judge Oryx said, boils down to whether Shin had a legal right to the tokens or not. Icon says he did not and was therefore not harmed by Revision 10. The inquiry at this stage, however, is whether Shin has plausibly alleged possessory interest in the ICX tokens. I find that he has, Judge Oric ruled. Shin plausibly asserts that he has a stronger claim to possession of and title to the ICX token than Icon because he minted, created, and staked a claim to the ICX tokens on the blockchain. And if you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.